we are going to do a fast food breakfast taste test. Yeah, let's yeah. go. It's 8.30 in the morning and I'm not going to be able to go back to sleep. Would you be able to? No, I would have just laid in my bed. We would have just been doing nothing. We're going to decide to be productive. First place is Chick-fil-A. Have you had Chick-fil-A breakfast? Yeah, I have. I have too, but I need to try it again to remind myself because I haven't had it in a long time. We got a lot of Chick-fil-A food. Let's start whipping around. So first thing we got to try was their coffee, and I think we're gonna get coffee from every place and compare. Yeah, like, I don't, I've never had their coffee. I don't like the, the black at the bottom. You gotta give it a little check, check, check. And then we got a breakfast burrito with hash brown sausage and egg. Sounds really good. And it comes with salsa for you to try it with. Listen to this, we're ordering, and I'm looking at the menu. I don't know why Chick-fil-A never gives you the menu. They just assume that you know what you want. <laughs> and I'm like, all right, like I knew Ada want, wanted chicken minis. I'm like, cool, I'm like, so four then? And she's like, 10. <laughs> so we got 10 chicken minis. But let's try this um, burrito first. Okay. Oh, she smells good. I love breakfast burritos. That's enough. That's thick. <laughs> I just took a second bite to actually get what's in there. So good. Really? The hash browns in there, it's so crunchy and yummy. You have to try it with the salsa. <laughs> She's eating it diagonal. All right, take a bite, girl. Did you take it with the salsa? Mm -hmm. Salsa's good, huh? Mm -hmm. I'm giving the breakfast sandwich a 10 out of 10. Me as well. Actually a nine out of 10 because they could have melted the cheese better. We're gonna try the coffee. The cheese could have been melted, but the hash browns in it, like when you bit into it, it had that crunch. It was so yummy. I want to make a breakfast sandwich like that at home. Ooh. Good? Pretty good. Good? <laughs> mm -hmm. 10 out of 10. I'll give this an 8 out of 10. That coffee's better. That coffee is better than Starbucks. Dunkin'. So the lady said that she tried the chicken minis with jam. So we have um, grape jam right here and strawberry. And we're gonna try it without the jam and then with the jam. Oh, oh my god. They look, <sighs> smells so good. She said it's really good with the jelly and it might start an addiction. Please support us in our journey to end Chick-fil-A addiction. For just a small donation, you can help these people out. I personally like it better without the jelly, but if I was like, I think I could eat a couple without and then a couple with the jelly. Overall, chicken minis, 10 out of 10. The overall rating for Chick-fil-A is a nine out, out of 10. 10. Okay, next up, I've been wanting to try this place's breakfast for so long. Taco Bell. Okay, we got a cinnamon delight. It's like Cinnabon. Iced coffee, which honestly sounds revolting. I don't know about it. California Crunchwrap Supreme. It's like the California style. So it's got a hash brown in it and like, is it like salsa or something? I have no idea. We I, were looking at the picture, but. I couldn't really read it. Yeah. I thought we should try the coffee first. Do you want to? Okay. Mm. My stomach hurts, I don't know. Mm -mm. Woo! Ooh. Really sweet and it's not cold. It's like warm. Really sweet, I feel like I'm like. I know. Oh my god. Like my stomach. Do not get that. I'm gonna say a five out of 10. Four out of 10, honestly. Yeah. My one favorite thing about Taco Bell is their hot sauce. All right, get her going. All right, we gotta get loaded up. Oh, that was a little bit much. I don't even see any. Oh, there it is. <laughs> okay, you ready? Yeah. <laughs> Big bite. Ada hit bacon. And the, the Crunchwrap Supreme, look what's all in there. It's like, Loaded. So many toppings. I guess it wouldn't be toppings. It was. It would be fillings. Okay. Coffee was a five out of ten. I'm gonna give this a good eight. I'm gonna give it a seven. Overall, Taco Bell is a six, six out of ten. ten. One sausage McGriddle. One bacon McGriddle, please. Bacon, egg, and cheese, or just bacon? Bacon, um, egg, and, bacon, cheese. Egg and cheese. Um, yeah, coffee. we're gonna do an iced vanilla coffee. We're switching it up. I'm in the back seat. <laughs> McGriddle. I just did a backflip. <laughs> Name someone else who can do that. I've never had a sausage, egg, and cheese McGriddle. Oh my god! So we're gonna try. She's it. excited. Bottoms up. Cheers. Delicious. Delicious. If I was actually hungry, I would eat this whole thing. Look at her bite. That's like a Squidward bite. <laughs> <laughs> um, you know, I'm not really into the pancake thing, but like the sausage and the cheese is really yummy. So I'm gonna give it a good eight out of 10. 
Kate is going in the back too. <laughs> this is my little seat now. So we got the bacon, egg, and cheese in the griddle. Mm, open her up. Oh! I didn't know that you just have to say bacon, egg, and cheese, so I just said the bacon <laughs> in the griddle, and then they gave me a, a bacon and two bacons, and mom <laughs> made me the egg when I got home. She's getting the coffee. Wash it down. I haven't Ooh. tasted the coffee yet either. Let me Ooh. try it. Sweet tea. I would give this a uh, 6 out of 10. No, actually, just plain. McDonald's, I love you. I'll give it an 8 out of 10. <laughs> Overall, McDonald's was 8, eight out, out of 10. 10. Thank you guys for watching our mukbang. Bye.